Hey everybody, Pastor Matt here. Hey, just wanted to talk to some of my favorite people in the world. The college and career age kids, the Soul Harvest Church, and our friends. And uh, I hope you're doing well back at college or whatever you're into. I was really blessed to see a lot of you over Thanksgiving. And uh, it just makes my day when I see you in church. And uh, I'm proud of you. And uh, a couple things I would share today. Uh, last week we called it uh, Cyber Week, or Cyber started off with Cyber Monday, followed up by Giving Tuesday, which was following Black Friday. And, you know, I, I don't have to tell you this, you're no stranger to technology, but technology really has changed our world over the last 20 to 30 years and, and beyond. And I guess what I want you to know today is, as many of us, you know, we've got all of our apps, you got your phones, and you're some of the smartest kids ever known to, to man with all the technology you have at your fingertips. Two things. Number one, there's no technology that can replace your relationship with Jesus Christ. And number two, there's no technology that can replace your relationship with other people. Your parents, your friends, your pastor, and other folks that God's put into your life. So thank God for social media. I would say Facebook, but then you'd all say I'm old. So thank God for Instagram and Snapchat and all of those things that you guys do. I know I'm not cool anymore. I don't even try to hide it. But here's the deal. I want you to know this today. Thank God for all those things. But thank God for a personal relationship with Jesus Christ. That you have a technology that supersedes Snapchat or Instagram. You have something called prayer, and you can talk to God anytime, anywhere, any place. And thank God for the power of human relationships, that we need each other. I need you. I need you in my life. I need you. I need your relationship. And I think you need me. You need your parents. You need your friends. And don't ever allow the devices in our hand to replace the wonderful people God has put in our life. Always fight for relationship. Conflict is the price of intimacy. Relationships will produce conflict, but the price is worth paying because the benefit outweighs the price. I love you very much. I think about you often. I pray for you often. I'll see you next week. God bless you.